Welcome back to Chem with Go. Today we're going to take a look at deriving the density term from the ideal gas equation. This is to find the density of a gas at a given um, pressure and temperature. Okay. Um, understand that if I multiply the number of moles, which is n, okay, times the molar mass, sorry, I just say molar mass, that would equal okay, the mass of the gas, or any other substance for that matter. Now, we can go ahead and rewrite this as n is equal to the mass divided by the molar mass, and I'll just put mm. Now, if that's the case, we can substitute that into the equation for n. So that gives you PV is equal to mass divided by molar mass okay, times RT. Now, remember that the density equation is just mass divided by the volume. If you've ever forgotten this, um, just think about the uh, heart. Okay, Density is equal to a heart with a line going through it, and it looks like an M on top and a V at the bottom. All right, now let's go back to the equation. If we manipulate this equation okay, to make it look like mass divided by the volume, it's just an algebraic problem. So if we substitute the V, okay, put it in the denominator over here, and then put RT as a denominator over on this side, and put molar mass up on top, we get an equation, basically mass divided by volume is equal to P times the molar mass divided by RT. And that's it. That's how to derive density from the ideal gas equation. Again, taking a look at this uh, basic sort of algebra manipulation, okay, we can derive the density, which is again mass divided by the volume, is equal to pressure times the molar mass divided by RT. And that's it. We'll take a look at the next lecture.